we're back. Please excuse the lighting. I am down one light. So, hope you guys can deal. Anyways, we have Sam E. Hashtag love you hater. Um, I've never heard of Sam E. I believe this is coming straight out of the Korean area. So for all my Korean Gs out there, love you guys. Love how much love how much support you guys send my way when it comes down to artists. So we're gonna check him out and let's see what Sam E is rapping about. All right. And and here we go. This is a genius song, a very truthful song. Hayden, let's say, say something. Hayden does three things. Three things. Three main things is what Hayden does. 
it does more than that, but that's just the spider web effect. But the core three things that hating does. One, whoever is being hated on either gets motivated or discouraged. So one and two right there. And then for the person who's doing the hating, it's nothing, it, it's not helping that person. It's nothing but destroying that person themselves. All they're trying to do is vent out their hate for themselves onto someone else. That's why the hating is there. Now, hating and hater is a loose term nowadays. So, I'm going to tell you what I think hating is. To me, hating on somebody is not having an opinion because you can have an opinion. To me, hating on someone is when you go out of your way to have an opinion about someone or someone's situation. That, to me, is hating. When you're talking about something, let's say you don't like an artist. Let's just pick an artist like Lady Gaga, right? You don't like Lady Gaga. Anytime music is brought up and you go out your way to include Lady Gaga so you can hate, that makes you a hater. Now, if you see Lady Gaga and you just have an opinion on one of her songs or maybe her performance or something like that and you don't like it, that's fine. See what I'm saying? That's my definition of hating. When a person goes out their way to constantly hate on something that you're doing, and I mean go out of their way, or to include you in a conversation, that's hate, that's slander. Now, if someone asks, someone, let's say someone knows my situation, and I did something, and they ask someone else's opinion, and that person's opinion is negative on what I, on what I did, They'll say, hey man, so and so was talking. He was hating on you, bro. He was talking shit about you, bro. I can't believe it, bro. And if you ask him, and he said, well, he asked me. Okay, that's just an opinion. That's not hating. That's not shit talking. That's just having an opinion. When that person goes out of their way to bring you into a conversation or to hate on you, then they're a hater. And those are the type of people that either going to make you stronger or they're going to discourage you. Believe me, I have them on this channel. People go out of their way to find every single vid of a category to hate on it. And just say, you only do these videos. When I have a list of almost 500 videos of different content. Real talk. But, like I say here on All Dudes Rap, don't feed the trolls. If you don't feed them, they won't stay. If you feed them, they'll stay and then they'll bring their friends and then they'll multiply. So don't feed the trolls. If you're in the comment section and you don't like what I do or you do like what I do and a troll comes around, don't feed them. Don't feed them. If you don't feed them, they'll go away. So don't feed the trolls. This song right here, really, really good. But that part about insurance customers, Calling him cancer. <laughs> that was awesome. That is an awesome, awesome way to look at a hater. Like your cancer. Like insurance. <laughs> insurance providers. I have customers for you. <laughs> oh man, that's good. That is freaking good. Well, that's going to do it for this reaction. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed that. But remember, if someone's hanging on you, no matter what you do, someone has an opinion. No matter what you're doing, someone is watching you. So, whether you're going to be a hater, a supporter, or a spectator, all depends on the person. And that's the way life goes. Don't, don't believe me? Just, just... Just self-evaluate your situation. Just do it. Just self-evaluate your situation. And watch. You're going to find haters. You're going to find supporters. And you're going to find spectators. Spectators are the people who ride the fence. Basically, they're waiting for you to succeed or fail. If you fail, they're going to jump over here and be like, man, I told you you shouldn't do that. If you succeed, they're going to jump over here and be like, bro, I always believed in you. You got the spectators, the haters, and the supporters. Everyone has them in their life. All right? So, this is going to be your boy. I'm Nixon. And I'm out.